It is said that there are between 25 and 50 active serial killers at any time in America, accounting for about 1 to 2 percent of all murders that occur each year. Now, a serial killer is typically a person who kills three or more people over a span of at least a month with significant time in between each killing. Wikipedia has a very long list of serial killers going back hundreds of years, listing the Harp brothers as the first known serial killing in America, active between 1797 and 1804, Samuel Little, known as the Choke and Stroke Killer, listed as having the most known victims at 61, but possibly as high as 93, and Henry Lee Lucas, who was active from 1960 to 1983, listed as having the most possible victims at over 200. He confessed to around 3,000 and was convicted of three. And apparently, in spite of what you hear on TV about serial killers, they're not all white, males between the ages of 30 and 45. At least 20% of serial killers are black and 17% women. With Alaska earning the honors of having the most serial killers per capita than any other state. But one of the newest serial killers who have yet to be caught in America may be running the streets of Stockton, California. Five people have been fatally shot in a residential area just north of downtown within a few block radius since July of this year. Police believe all five homicides are related. This image is of who the police are calling a person of interest, although he is yet to be identified. All of the victims were walking alone in the evening or early morning when they were killed and ranged in age from 21 to 54, four of which were Hispanic and one was white. The first victim was 35-year-old Paul Alexander Yaw on July 8th, then 43-year-old Salvador de Budi on August 11th, followed by a 21-year-old man on August 30th, a 52-year-old man September 21st, and 54-year-old Lorenzo Lopez on September 27th. All of the victims were ambushed, none were robbed, and none were gang-related. The city of Stockton has a $75,000 reward for information leading to his arrest, and Crime Stoppers added another 10000 to that. Stockton has a population just over 300000 and a murder rate similar to Chicago. Support this channel and pick yourself up some original crime-related apparel. Look for the link in the description.